written off the wall But tonight I'm letting it go Spend my coin for sure I'm gonna be myself I'm gonna be someone else Oh my god no, Boy, your house is gone Dude That's hot Oh my god 2021 will be a much better year Look the snowflakes of 2020. Ash. Of a burning Christmas tree, something that would be so happy. Isn't it fitting? It's very fitting. Twenty twenty one started and I was so excited for a new year. But then it started raining and it never stopped. I used to have a job, but I got laid off. I used to have a wife, but she said she had enough. I used to have a car, but it got repossessed. It seemed the Lord have found someone he likes to test. I've lost all the make a lose, that's why I sing the blues. Are on our last few square hay bales. Oof. So we're gonna give them to the cows. Hopefully I don't drown while I'm out there. And then we are gonna go buy some round bales for the first time and just hopefully leave them out there. I was thinking about our winters and I remember being so disappointed that we never got snow days really in school like most of the kids or that one Nickelodeon movie but look what I'm walking through holy smokes Ugh. oh my god okay um but we would get a lot of flood days so every so often it would rain for so much so long usually a month or two straight, that, um, yeah, they'd have to shut the school down and tell everyone not to come in or to go home because all the roads would be flooded over and we wouldn't be able to make it in. Anyways, if you ever think about moving to Washington, you can look forward to some lovely flood days. Mommy, I didn't tell you upstairs. Who? Sawyer. Why? Because he doesn't want curry? Uh-huh. Because he's so hiding. You guys, that is so hurtful. I can't believe my two-year-old doesn't want curry. Sarah, Sarah, it's not hiding. Are you going to eat curry? No. Are you coming in here to judge me? No. I was going to do a nice script. cameo appearance. I'm waiting here. Hold up. How's my makeup? How's your makeup? <laughs> Look good. looking good. Oh, so miserable. You're doing good. Thank you. Ow! Keep it up. I don't know if... Alfie. So, I don't know if Max has mentioned this on his channel or um, if I've mentioned this in the previous video, but one of our biggest goals for this year and just in life in general is to try and figure out a way to get our property to pay for itself. Cause the mortgage is so painful. You want to know? You want to know who did this? Our mortgage did this. It hurts us. <laughs> it hurts us badly. Yeah. 
But yeah, that's the goal though, right? To uh, to get the farm to pay for itself. So when we bought the place, we were stretched super thin and it was a big risk. We're but, still super stretched thin. But we knew that, you know, we weren't doing that for... Alvin! To do this, we have three open-ended endeavors that we've started so far. So we have the cattle farm, we have the tiny house Airbnb, and then we will hopefully soon tear down our old hundred year old sketchy barn and do a wedding venue. We need all three of those endeavors to somehow earn us $36,000 a year in order to reach our goal and have the property kind of pay for itself and for the mortgage to be covered by our own land and property. We worked really hard this past week, right before Max had no surgery, to get the cows situated with round bales instead of the square bales. So we, we tried doing that and um, it worked at first. And then Max had his nose surgery. Brought strawberries. That's nice. I am the Sphere who went up the hill. Get down with all the strawberries. Leaving the inhabitants of the hill with no strawberries. Leaving the name upon myself, a selfish. Handsome. Don't, don't, don't. I want to take it. it off. No, I don't. They said no. Don't do that. You're not allowed to take it off. I want to see. No. This is my it's nose's not, birthday. It's not going to be accurate anyways, not until it's all said and done. You Happy nose. Wait. Happy birthday to my new nose, says November 8th. Then the hardest part was when we got back home and Max was recovering from his surgery and I went out to check on the cows and how they were doing with the round bales of hay. Des, what's going on with the hay? Well, we tried replacing our square bales with a bunch of round bales and then I came back here today to open one up and it is riddled with mold. Like this is more successful at growing mushrooms than my freaking mushroom growing kit. <laughs> so here's a little bit of it. It's kind of deep in oh, there. Yeah, but uh look at this. Looks like a salami. I pulled off as much mold as I could from the bale that I have them eating on right now. And we were talking to some farmer friends and they said that's pretty common. You just still have to be careful. So hopefully everything is smooth sailing from there. But uh it was a little bit stressful. Is that beer in a teacup? <laughs> Despite a rocky start to the year, I'm actually really excited for everything that we have coming on in 2021. You know, some things just have to get worse before they get better. And like Washington weather, sometimes you just have to go through a gross winter to get to the beautiful spring. The end. Oh. This is fine. <laughs> but, so, Welcome to Washington. Dude, can you imagine if this 600 pound bale just broke loose and landed on you? I was thinking that. That'd be a weird way to die. Crotch punched you, right? <laughs> a thousand ways to die. <laughs> Only they'd make me look like a huge bitch because they always do. <laughs> yeah. She was rude to her husband that day. <laughs> so this bale of hay right from the was a stinking bitch. She always complained about the mud. 